Chapter 58 Noah had no intention to do such a thing, but Scarlet was overpowering his decision and he had no choice but to compromise to her shenanigans. However, the attendees were not surprised at all. When she announced how much each gift was worth, they could judge how well or bad their old classmates were doing after graduation. After all, comparison and jealousy were human nature. Then, Scarlet started the announcement. Thank you, Bill, for your $1,000. Thank you, and, for the pair of gold ingots. Thank you, Potter, for the beautiful vase. Thank you, Bob Lesnar, for your $15,000. The first few gifts, whether money or physical items, were mostly worth around $1,000. Suddenly, when it came to Bob, his $15,000 monetary gift sent a shock wave across the restaurant. $15,000 was a big amount for the opening ceremony. Many people looked at Bob with amazement and praised his generosity. Bob had a layer of smugness on his face. It seemed that he had easily become the icon of admiration among his old classmates. Then, Scarlet continued, Thank you, Alex and Emma, for the old painting. Sinister laughter echoed across the main hall upon her announcement. Old painting? Was it even worth a hundred dollars? Those two were a little too stingy, weren't they? Noah had prepared such a lavish banquet for the opening ceremony as well as the class reunion that cost a few hundred dollars per person, how dare they come with an old painting? How could they be so shameless? Bob started sneering. Alex, you can afford a BMW 340 and its modification, why are you giving such a tattered thing on your old pal's opening day? Alex smiled faintly. You don't even know its origin, why do you say it is tattered? Don't think I don't know what you're thinking about. You've bought the fake and nasty stuff to pass off as good stuff so we can't figure out how much it costs. Then, he continued in an interrogative tone, honestly, how much did that old painting cost you? One hundred? Or eighty dollars? The faint smile remained on Alex's face. The painting is more valuable than the total amount of all the gifts today. Ha ha ha, Bob laughed wickedly. Did you rehearse the bragging part before you came here? I gave them $15,000 and we have about 20-something classmates here. If each of them has given Noah $1,000, it would add up to 20-something thousand dollars. Do you mean to say that the painting is worth more than 30000 More than that. Ha ha ha. Suddenly, thunderous laughter amplified inside the restaurant. All of them thought that Alex was too ignorant and pompous. How dare he boast about the price of that and what's more, in front of everyone. An ancient painting that was worth tens of thousands of dollars? Was he trying to fool them all? Scarlet, who was standing on the stage, was annoyed and agitated by Alex's reaction. She curiously asked, Mr. Alex, I wonder whose painting you've given us that is so worthy. Alex answered in a monotonous voice, a painter from the Dutch Golden Age, not very famous. Scarlet chuckled and said, oh, what a coincidence. My father is a renowned cultural relic appraiser, his name is Lord Henry, who knows his antique very well. I believe you have heard of his name before. Mia exclaimed in surprise, Lord Henry? The Lord Henry, the antique expert? I remember him, I saw him on TV. He's your father? Scarlet smiled. Yes, he is my father. He's upstairs right now. Why don't I ask him to come down and appraise this ancient painting that Alex has given us? Bob stood up and uttered loudly, Yes, please. Scarlet, please invite your father down and get him to help us identify the painting. If the value of that painting really exceeds the amount of all the gifts today, I, Bob Lesnar, will eat this table right away.